and I want to say that it's safe to say group I'm on mode 100% is not passing. I put my life on this, right? If it passes, Jesus can come and smite me down. That's how confident I am. One eye open when I'm sleeping. One eye. I took the biggest L of mankind. If GIM would have failed and if that would have caused raids to fail, at that point, you just take out the polling system, right? I still feel bad for the PvP community. Now they're gonna get it even worse. People are gonna make sure a lot of this, their stuff don't pass. And to be quite honest, any system where one community can dominate another community like that, you, you gotta, like, I still feel you should take it out. The last thing I'll say on this is because I see a lot of people say this, I see a lot of people say no polls equal EOC. That is wrong. If they wanted to add EOC, even if we still had the polling system, it would be added under integrity, just like the rebalancing change, just like them removing dueling arena. I think it's safe to say and to confirm that the dual arena will be removed in the long term and it will be replaced with more engaging game content. I believe that's going to be under integrity, meaning no polls. So no, polls are not protecting us from EOC. I believe it's them not wanting to make the same mistake twice that's protecting us from EOC. Recently, the old school team gave us even more updates of what's to come. That's That caught me off guard because they already had the summit, right? Where they told us what was coming. They were like, nah, let's drop more stuff on you. Like they were talking about adding next, removing the dueling arena. Like there's a lot of stuff to talk about. The first thing I, I'm going to talk about is next, because I do believe they might have to be careful with that. And I see that they are being careful. What kind of things is she going to drop? Because ultimately that's almost the most important thing about having next. The old school team already made the mistake once, in my opinion, with Soul Wars. Beautiful content came from RuneScape. A lot of people liked it. However, it became dead because the rewards were absolute garbage. Tell me one time you've seen someone running around with a Soul Wars cape. Never have you seen that because it is useless, which is a shame because it's such a good piece of content. But nowadays people just want to make use of their time. We're all growing old. We can't just be doing Soul Wars for fun. You gotta give us incentive to go. You look at pest control. I'm, I'm literally asleep when I'm doing that piece of content, but why am I there? For void. The reward matters right that's just what i'm trying to say they said they're not going to be adding tover pernix and vertis which is good because i do believe that was the pinnacle of where eoc just went downhill that armor was really really op and that's where the power creep was kind of went out of control however it would be nice if they would have added as cosmetic and um or an ornament kit because that piece of armor was absolutely beautiful i'm talking about the pre-eoc one the eoc one oh my god what the divine spirit shield would honestly make sense to me coming out of next it just would i have faith in the old school team to make some kind of useful reward that would come out of uh that boss who was super fun to fight i remember fighting her those were the days next thing they talked about was removing the dueling arena which is kind of big the only thing is that the money sink from the dueling arena was really good and i do believe the only way to replicate that kind of a gold sink is ge tax that no one wants or not a lot of people want but overall it's going to help the game so I, I believe they should add it in my opinion they also talked about cracking down on RWT and focusing more on people who buy gold. I wonder what kind of impact that's going to have. They showed us some stuff coming out of Leaks 3 and I got to say this is so beautiful. Old school art team is going in. Oh my god, look at this cannon, bro. Look at this cannon. Some people don't like how it looks. I don't know why, right? I just maybe they want the game to look more old school or old fashioned, but I think that kind of looks nice. 